Hello everyone, this is Zerus Trivia. Welcome back to our channel as we kick off a brand new Let's Play series on the channel featuring Assassin's Creed Valhalla. Now previously we did play Assassin's Creed Odyssey, which by the historical time frame is the prequel to this game. So we finished that game with 100% completion, we did all the DLC missions, we looked at even the real world events, and we're going to see that continue to unfold here as the main storyline of the Assassin's Creed lore will continue in this part of the venture as we go back to the Viking Age, the 9th century, you know, England, Norway, and play as a Viking assassin i guess uh, we'll see how the story itself unfolds this is launch day very excited and can't wait to dive into the game so let's start a new game and let's see exploration difficulty adventures more icon will guide you towards your reward explorer is default feedbacks on the world map opportunities and regular information on compass or pathfinder minimum hud world map information for more immersive experience. We're going to go with Pathfinder. So we're going to enjoy the world as is. And combat difficulty goes from Scald, Viking, Berserker, Dragger. Uh, we're going to go with very hard. Uh, we pretty much play most games at the highest difficulty. It doesn't mean we'll succeed, but we'll give it a shot. So let's go with this intense combat setting for the Ultimate Warrior. Enemy health and damage outputs are increased. You may adjust this difficulty setting at any time, and we might, depending on how things go. Uh, it didn't stop us in Assassin's Creed Odyssey. We got killed by legendary beasts all the time, and they are going to be legendary animals in this one as well, so excited for that. And stealth difficulty. Yes, a lot of the stealth aspect of the game is making a big comeback in this game. You're going to see a lot of callbacks to older Assassin's Creed games, whether you're just blending in with the crowd or other stealth elements. And we're going to go with a hard one, Master Assassin, Guards Perceptions Increase for Enhanced Realism. Let's see if that's true, uh, thus adding significant challenges. And there we go. Let our adventure begin. children of gods, and heed my tale of time's beginning. All was dark. There was no sand. There was no sea. No earth, nor sky. No grass, nor wind. From this green came the giant Ymir, first of all beings. Proud Ymir, cruelly killed. Yet from whose bones and blood and brains the world was made. The world you walk and war upon. Alright, seems like we're in control now. This is young Eivor, and part of this game is this gender ambiguity. You're allowed to play as both, but it's not a choice like in Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Apparently you are both at the same time. We don't know exactly what that means, but right now we have a little boy or a little girl. The voice reminded me a little bit of a girl, but then before puberty, boys sound like that too. And we look pretty dressed up. And we're here in a very nice hall in a room. We found a little bracelet. And uh, I guess we go for the door. And we have a party. I mean, he knows our name, but apparently no interactions. Oh, 
there you are, my little drinker. Go. So, you see our king? Yes, good. Come, Eva. Uh, did you find the, the ring? Yes. Now, now for our little plan. You see us talking. Be quiet as a wood mouse. And surprise him with our gift. You hold it out, like this. You look him in the eyes and you say, Steerbjorn King, may our clans be forever bonded in friendship and in love. I think you can do that for me. Mm -hmm. Good. Tonight, you will be the court that unite our people. I'm so proud of you, Eva. Get up, Olaf. Stay lucid, friend. My sword is grown greedy. I'm ready to fight. So nice having all of these hearty so folk. So that was our father, and apparently we can dance. Why not? Just ignore our dad's very solemn duty and skip around and dance for a little bit. I'm leaning towards a little girl. Anyways, that's enough dancing. Let's go do our job. I killed the heads of Charles Hill Dogs. I imbibed Odin's brew and I snipped the scraggly beards of troll kings. I danced naked upon the bleaching beaches. Okay, he's not gonna stop. Drink, Colgar, and sit. Oh, no drink in your fist? Come on, I'll find you something. I can't. I have a tribute for your father. Oh, what a piece. That must be worth two sturdy long chips. Give it here. I'll pass it on. My father asked me, Sigurd. Suit yourself. But you're not getting any mead. Did we Marcus say we Sater want any? Works through my hammer. <laughs> More dancing, arm wrestling. When you speak with the king, hold it up to the light. Show him the fine details. See there? I etched his name in runes on the outer band. You'll show him? Mm -hmm. You're just like your father, little berserker. Skull to you. Skull! You see? She agrees. All right, taking on the next competitor. We can play. What do we play? Wait, what do we play? This is playing? Oh, oh, hold on. We are playing. We're going to play something. What are we going to play with? Look at our hand. A ball of yarn. This is, this is a really sad play. We're throwing a ball of yarn in a party. Anything fancy? Nope, that's it. Alright. Have the ring? Good. This was worn by your grandfather in a battle on the Northern Way. Mother? Yes? Can we show Sigurd the can stones his dad gave today? That's a good idea. We'll do that in the morning. First light.
clans be forever bonded in friendship and love. <gasps> Thank you, Eivor. Now and forever, I am pledged to you. <laughs> Hearken well in Hall of Kings. On ocean steed, my words gain wings. Oh, then speed I forth will bring. The noble deeds that honor sing. The brave men slain, Valkyria waves. Rewards for strange of our little tales, and horns resound the mighty horn. For those who fight, for those who fight. Ready yourself, men. Not you, Faber. Not just yet. So... We're under attack. Can we grab one of these axes? Something? Are we supposed to go out and watch the fighting? It is foretold. The curtains are raised. Nothing is true until it is severed from the branches of Yggdrasil. Can you grab this axe? If I give my life, will you spare my clan? You have my word. No. No, Baron. No, Aaron. Pick up your axe! No. Kill them all!
different data streams overlapped in the same DNA. Not sure why. Fix this or pull me out. I can parse the streams with a filter. Hold on. Okay, we're good. Are we? I don't know what happened, but I can work around it. You'll have to pick a stream to keep things stable. There's a third option, too. I can let the Animus modulate your identity based on signal strength. It's up to you. Oh, that is weird. Okay. So we can play as female Eivor, male Eivor, or the default options to Animus represent the stronger female or male memory stream depending on its current strength. I'm actually super curious about this one. Let's do this. Let's alternate and figure out why this memory stream is this way. And for those of you who are watching Assassin's Creed game for the very first time, quick explanation, we're in the future and they have these machines called the Animus which can read a strand of DNA and recover the life memory of that DNA as long as the user of the machine is a descendant from that DNA. So we're playing as one of these assassin descendant, Layla. She's been the protagonist since Origins. Assassin's Creed Origins, which is based in Egypt, Odyssey, which is based in Greece, and now we're in the Viking Age here in Valhalla, and she's in this machine, and she's reading this memory strand of Eivor, and we don't know if Eivor is male or female. Apparently there's like a, some sort of filter overlap between two possibilities. In Odyssey, you had the choice of two different people, two siblings, which everyone gets thrown off the cliff. Uh, and that's kind of how we decided. Here it feels like we are one character, but somehow the male and female memories are different. So let's see why. All right, I'll lock it in and push ahead to a time where these streams are more synchronized. How long have you been chasing me, Wolfkist? Seventeen winters? Eighteen? Do I now haunt your dreams? Do I warm your loins? <laughs> you remember this? Oh, your father sacks. The weapon of a coward. A scorn snake. Ah, few things would please me more than to kill with this blade. But I know you would defy me to the death, fighting for a glorious end. That I will not allow. You will live your final days enthralled as a slave, humiliated. Your death will be a lonely one. <laughs> Kill the rest of our crew! Make them suffer! Ava Wolfkist is no more! That name is dead to this world! You will be worth your weight in silver. <laughs> Foolish shit. You move. And I take your eyes, you hear me? Wind's blowing from the south. We can tack north, then cut west. Now, what did I just tell you? for you, Sunan. My crew is in danger. You must be my eyes. 
Alright, so instead of Eagle, we get a Raven, and Sunan seems to be the name. And uh, we're supposed to get used to controls, I guess. And there we have a familiar vintage point. Now, that sequence reminds me a little bit of old Jackie Chan movies. My crew is in danger. I need to reach them. And how we do that. Odin sight, okay. We should be able to mark stuff. Nothing nearby? Nothing gets marked? Oh, 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 never mind. Here's some marks. Better. Uh, we're healing from the food. Okay. Anything else get marked? I'm just not seeing. Oh, one click is... Okay. This is very similar to Odyssey here. So hold V for the scan. Tap V for Raven Vision now. So here are some footprints. I'm guessing we're scaling that wall. I mean the trail... Okay, well that doesn't look suspicious at all. But this might be the vantage point. Feels like there's no enemies nearby for a long time. So let us get moving. Now is there... Oh, uh, so they're all going to be marked with the little dots. Nothing inside, though. Guess we can practice a few combat on them. Ah, more food. I feel better. Stronger. Yeah, so apparently healing this game is based on eating food. So... Extra food you collect becomes rations, and you can eat those or consume them in combat to heal. Save that for later. Right, enough food was collected to create a ration, and then hit H to heal. So, collecting whether resources or food or arrows in this case is going to be important. Let us. I hear sound. It's actually quite hard to. See if your scan yeah, resulted in anything. Oh, right. I guess we have to upgrade our ration limit if we want to hold more healing, basically. Well, we managed to secure our some arrows. We are full healed, rationed up. Let's move. There must be other resources aside from food. But right now, it's basically all berries. I'm assuming we're scaling this one. Yep. It's a little... Ooh, there's a snow fox. Oh, we missed our chance. Hopefully there would be stuff here. I cannot pronounce that, but that's basically where our home was. Focus. Wait, why do we want to focus here? Huh. Anything brought from those boxes? Nope, nothing. Pretty sure we're scaling that vantage point now. Where that oath breaker is holding my crew. Okay, so now we know where it is.
Show me what lies ahead. A little camp. I don't see anyone there, though. They really put a lot of terrain between us and the camp. Ooh, I'm pretty sure we can hunt that. There we go. Leather. So there's no resource displaying off the fox. Ooh. So I'm using the color code. This is probably wealth. Right, because we see wealth, artifacts, and all sorts of things here. Alright, let's get our jump out of the way. Wait, that doesn't look like a... That doesn't look like a typical leap of faith. There's no diving motion. Maybe I did it wrong. But the pond looks correct. Wait, how do I rise to the surface? Controls, controls, controls. Wait, C? No, C's dive. Ah, so he's gone. Right. The water almost killed us. Right, it's freezing. Better be a hot spring. It's a little bit unsatisfying with the leap of faith. Oh, there is someone there. Hold on. You Stretch missed, your wings. Sir. You missed him. Friendly, or should I just try to snipe him? Doesn't look so friendly. One of Chatve's men. I need to be careful. <gasps> the guards here are vigilant. We should be able to just pull the arrow off his head and still be able to use it. There we go. Can we get that axe? What's the point of breaking these? There's no items. Oh, arrows. Different types of arrows. Silver. Uh, cannot collect any more food, sadly. Let's go directly to our crew. Ooh, there's some animals. I just want to make sure I can kill them with one hit so I don't lose the arrow. One leather. Oh, that's going to take a long time to collect. Ah. Impact on the snow. Okay, two leather on this one. Those are wolves? Or foxes, not sure. Only got experience. Got the arrow back. Cast about this land, my friend. There's a hut. Let's go check it out. Does it have a door? Oh, there's something inside. Oh, there's a door. Uh, maybe we shouldn't be so afraid. There we go. Alright, iron war, leather. Ricky wolf. 
Prepare the child of Varen for the slavers. You may use others for your blood sacrifice. Okay, so whoever this Ricky will has blood sacrifice in store. Ooh, there's some finally some loot that dropped. Empty box. I guess we sell that. So I guess our crew's fate is gonna be um, some sort of sacrifice. Let's stop that. Chatvis warriors. I should stay out of sight. Go, oh. my eyes. Two of them. We can Best not to draw attention here. Try to shoot one. Get a little bit of slow. Missed the arrow though. The slow reload is a little weird. Is that a free shield? Oh no, that's just the lid. Hmm, I don't like how we have to scan everywhere. I never took the scanning skill when playing Odyssey, but I guess we have to do it now. Especially since we're just learning the game. Uh, we'll explore later. We'll rescue our crew first. That long house over there should be the destination. Clash of Iron. There is fighting nearby. Okay, I'm supposed to just go there. I can't do anything right now except for walk. Dag, you old hound. You live. I do. Slipped away in the sword clash. And what of you? Chotve tried to sell me off. A mistake he'll regret. Not today he won't. I saw him board a ship at Aval's Nest not long ago. Sailed east, leaving our crew behind. There must still be time to save our men. I will find them. You ready the longship. You glory hound. You would take the rescue for yourself, so the victory song is written about you. I could storm the beach then, slay two dozen men, seize our dragon boat, and hoist the sail in triumph. Up to you. No, no, I will take the beach. A far more dangerous path. You search the long house for our crew. Oh, and here. This corpse will not have need of it. Go. I'll meet you by the ship. Okay. Raven Clan Shield. There are three main slots for weapons. Each weapon is unique and comes with their own fighting styles. Exclamation mark display a new piece of gear is looted. Main hand on the left. Main source of damage. Right, you can dual shields as well. Supportive fighting style. Two hands would use both weapon slots. Pretty sure there's going to be a perk that lets you one hand a two hander. Alright, a bow is always long range, three types of bow, each would use own ammo. Well, this is basically telling us to equip the shield. We'll do it. There's attack, speed, stun, weight, critical... What is crit pre? Percentage? No, that's wrong. P-R-E. Prevention? Critical hit prevention? Block chance? Okay. Block temporary, blocking temporarily increases light damage. Increase heavy attacks after each light attack hit. Okay. I don't even know how to use a heavy attack, but sure thing. We have our shield. Uh, so this is block. Okay, good enough. Pretty sure we can break these. 
Yeah, but no loot. He's going to the beaches. I'm supposed to storm the longhouse. Sunan, guide me. There's a house here. Is there going to be another loot opportunity here? Nope. Well, you can go inside. Let's smash everything. And apparently there's that's a loot on the ground, right? Yeah, there we go. Five silver. Alright, wasn't wasted. We call that wealth. Let's go save our crew. Holes in the compass. Oh, okay. So the big significant stuff will tell us. Alright, this is not interactable. Shirtless warriors crawl through Arval's nest like lice. If I use the main gate, I may attract attention. So let's not use the main gates. What do you see, Sunan? Yeah, this is our zone. Oh, there's some nice grass right here. I don't see any guards. Oh, there's one. We have to manually mark them now if we want to mark them, which I'm okay with. Oh, but there are a ton of guards inside. Okay. I mean, this is our target, and looking at where the tall grass are, I think this gate is friendlier, and all these V-shaped areas we can enter from. So let's do that. I must be careful now. Wait, we already located it, didn't we? We have to click it? Oh no, they're just saying the crew is in this zone. There's also a wealth here. What do they want me to scan? I feel like they're trying to make me use the raven to locate the crew, which is like clearly in here, but like, do I have to mark something? There's a scaffolding, and we can enter from the ceiling, I feel like it. Ah, there's people inside. We can actually. Yeah, that's fine. I, I know what to do. We're gonna go behind the longhouse. Use the scaffolding, go through the ceiling. Santa Claus coming in. A long house. My crew should be inside. All right, so we're basically gonna sneak to the back side or use whatever scaffolding we can find. Maybe this one. That is a guard. Pretty sure that is a guard. I need your eyes, my friend. Yep, that is a guard. That is a guard. That is wealth. Let me see, we go for the wealth first. Ingots, book of knowledge, or gear. Oh wow. Odin Sight finds all the guys, okay. Ingots, okay. Pretty sure these are used to craft weapons and such. This is a barred gate. But since we're inside, I'm pretty sure we can open it. But there's a window. Why bother with doors? All right, this guard is kind there of alone. Be an opening in the roof. We might have to hide the body. Of course, shot through the brain, so you know, no blood on the ground. You know, it's just snow. 
All right, there we go. No one's gonna miss him. He left. Can we just climb? <gasps> will miss your neck. Unpleasant for both of us. Time to die. I want to make a mess of it, Bakraut. This is the Ricky Wolf character. Wait, where he's farther below us. I can't. Doesn't doesn't reach him. He's not he's not he's through the wooden Alright, I can shoot him from here. Unbind me and stick an axe in my hand. I owe you nothing, raven shit. Yours is a clan of thralls and peasants. You! Lay that axe aside or die by mine. You should be on a slave ship to Ireland, Wolfkist. But if you wish to be my first sacrifice... Odin will be more than happy to receive you. You just killed yourself, Erki. Right. I will send you to hell herself. Halt all the songs? Oh, Wolf gotta get used to that. And I will spare your life. Shut your hole and fight. Die, you sack of shit. Shift heavy attack. Okay. Oh, uh, one heavy attack and we're out of stamina. Great. Oh, gotta dodge. Uh, two hit us. Okay. Right, number two. Kneel, wolf kissed, and I will spare your life. Shut your hole and fight. So a lot of dodging. Die, you sack of shit. Or when landing light attacks. Okay. Ooh. There we go. Oh, apparently there should be a weak spot, right? On the arms. Oh, stun. Should have done that. You're not going anymore. Grab us? Ooh. Wait, what, what, what? We could parry him? Alright, we have a shield. Oh, he's switched to two axes. Okay, let's not do that. Let's eat, eat our ration. I'm gonna try to carry once. There we go. Oh, bad timing. You know what? Oh, out of stamina, out of stamina. No, no. Here we go. Father, 
You should have held on to this until the bitter end. If I give my life, will you spare my clan? Let it know! Pick up your axe! Kill them all! No! I guess we follow. Find us. What? Oh, yes, of course. All right, time to save our crew. Oh, why do we dodge now? Got so used to dodging. I want to check this out. Anything else here? Guess not. Let's just save our crew. And grab some arrows as well. And there's a bunch more crew. Even if your wits were somewhat rattled. Listen here. If you can breathe, you can fight. Now come. We take back our ship. You do not need to tell us twice. Not breathing. There's gonna be guards outside. Uh, no. I didn't want to whistle. Get behind! Dead. All over for you! Die, you I will take on the easy folk. No. Shield broke. Okay. Everything. Oh. We get caught in one attack and we die. Even if your wits were somewhat rattled. Listen here. If you can breathe, you can fight. Now come. We take back our ship. You do not need to Alright, take two. Twice. We'll be a little bit more careful. I want to do the stun attack. Oh, nice. Alright, that's a good finish. Let's just do that more often. Oh, oh, we got him. Can we get close to him?
Can't let me do it. Nope, still good. Let me do it. Alright, we'll just kill. Back off our guy. We just have to reach the long ship? Like, is this never gonna end? It kind of feels that way. But we are getting experience, so this is probably is the easiest combat we're gonna see, even though I just got one shot by one of these. I mean, it makes sense. If you get hit by an axe like that, you know, you die. Alright, some loot. Oh, rations are actually filled. Aiming right behind us. Ah. Ah, we got a bloody axe for a reason. But what are you guys all looking at? Here. Read a request. A storehouse is sealed and safe from thief. The roof is weak. Storehouse. I mean, are they talking about? Hmm. Seems to be another place with treasure, but maybe now is not the time to go treasure hunting. I mean, we do have a crew here. I mean, we are looting silvers. All right, where is the crew? helping. See? Oh, our crew is down. We can revive, I believe. I believe we can revive. Yep. Get back up. You're not gone yet. Back off. A lot of loot. Wait, they're still defending against someone? Where are the beach? That's her. Oh, they're murdering someone in the water. Archer, huh? There we go. Some partial aim assist help there. We'll take it. Can I get the arrow back from the body? There we go, we got it. Let's get out of here. <laughs> Dag, Reggie, grab your oars. The whale road leads us home. Gods, it's about time. Stop yapping and start rowing. Which way's home? That way? Oh, open the sail. Sail out! I don't know if I'm going the right way. Rather silent, Davor. Bring the sail in. For the mess you led us to? Wait. We suffered no losses in this fight. I feel like. And the men who humiliated us are dead. I feel like. What is there to say? Oh, something like I was stupid, selfish, reckless, blind. Run up the stairs! I smell like blood and shit. I like my version better. We'll let the auto routing guide us for a little bit. It's 
cinematic camera. Let's check that out. Ooh. Okay, let's just exit this dramatic scene here. Sail down! I messed it up again. There is a map, right? Okay, there is a map. Yeah, we left a lot of wealth points and other mysteries. Oh, we're supposed to go here. That is far. Okay. Sail up. More sails! That looks like a nice building. Not our destination, though. Let's first return home. Eivor, look! Someone is setting up an outpost on that island. Shut this men. Gnawing at any piece of open land like dogs worrying a bone. Even with you half in the grave, we could easily take them. Let's sail! Are, are we supposed to... No, let's go home first. We'll Let do the these great stuff out. next time. We have plenty of stuff to do in the open world. So we can attack this small settlement with our crew. Giltve will come for us now. Harder and stronger than before. No surprise there. This war has spun on for three generations. I hardly expect him to relent. Your hatred for that man burns bright wolf kissed. I could warm my balls on it. Would you not prefer a pair of sealskin breeches? Just take care, Eivor. Such hatred can make you careless. What he did to your father, he did to all of us. You are not in this fight alone. Just a quick check with the map would be nice. Do we have to take the sail off? Well, I can't pull off the map. Oh, there we go. Alright, go slightly north. Okay. Sail! Catch the wind! You guys don't have to use your wars. The captain now knows the way. That looks like a vantage point. King Sterbjorn will scold you for setting out against his wishes. Of course he will. Is that not something you worry over? I worry only that our king will not see that I am right until it's too late. What about Sigurd? What would he say? If Sigurd were here, he would be sitting beside you, wiping the blood from his axe and smiling into the breeze. So it seems like they survived. Just our father and mother died. And what will you tell our king about this misadventure? Only the truth. We attacked Kjotve's fortress, killed his men, and weakened his control of this land. Will you mention the part where you lost your crew and were nearly sold as a thrall? Will that be part of your saga? If there's a skull who dares sing that verse, it'll be his last song. Alrighty, we're home. Maybe sail down. Reef sail! Hey, hold on you. That's a very nice docking maneuver. Well, well, the feeder of ravens returns. And not half dead. We thought we had lost you, Eivor. For good this time. A warm welcome as always, Ranvi. You look like red and shit. What happened? Nothing to crow about. Except to say the men who delayed us are dead. And how are you? Well enough. Though I have spent many tiresome days calming the rages of our king. He is not happy with you. I expected as much. And what of Sigurd? Has he returned from his raids? My husband should be home today. The last we heard he was approaching Stavanger. Good to hear. We have need of his courage. Sigurd will not save you from his father's wrath, Eivor. You should know that by now. Did your raid not go as planned? They rarely go as planned. But we killed many of Kjotve's warriors. And there was this. My father's axe among the dead. Ah. Oh. After so many years. You should take it to Gunnar. He will give it back its edge. 
A good idea. After I see our king. That I do not advise. Not yet. He is meeting with a messenger from the north. I can wait. A cloud hangs over you. Is something wrong? Seeing my father's axe after 17 winters. It stirred something in me. A feeling I have not had since. Since the day he was killed. Since the day I got this. Memories of past agonies. Of sadness and pain. I should speak with Volka. She could help me make sense of my... My feelings. Take your time getting settled. I will see you at the Longhouse. I think you have lost your edge, Eivor. Just like that axe. Maybe Gunnar can help you with both. I will let you know. Alright, we have completed our first quest, Honor Bound. Uh, not cleanly. We died twice already on this difficulty. Uh, we leveled up, picked up two skill points, and uh, we are going to pick things back up next time from here. As we will get ourselves acquainted with our new settlement here and how the game functions and hopefully not die as much. So, hope you guys enjoy this one and we'll see you all next time. Bye!